guys, Cosmic Flame here today with a new YouTube video. And today I'm going to be listing five features in Mad City that are disagreeable. They aren't even that good. And Mad City is basically a game that took over Roblox for the top spot. He's trying to kill me! Ah. Hey, go away! Okay, whatever. Uh, basically, I'm going to be listing five reasons or features in this game that just aren't the greatest and they're pretty bad and uh let's get on to the first one the first reason over here number one number uno or whatever you go out here and if you just press on the letter m if you're on uh computer you can go away stupid stupid Uh, so one of the reasons is if you go to click M, and you can take out your phone, and if you go over here, you can click on spawn, you can spawn in a boat, a Camaro, or a helicopter, and it's easy, you don't, no requirements, you just do it. You walk outside, there's this kid, bro, just die! M, you can spawn in a helicopter and just right as you exit the prison, and you can go anywhere in this helicopter. It's not like you have to earn your way out of the prison, or you have to walk, or you have to take a car that you have to get without any car, um, camping cops. Everyone gets their own helicopter, their own car, or whatever, and it's not, it doesn't make sense. Why would they do this? I don't know. Let's get on to the second reason. If you are a superhero, like if you go to t um, Teams menu, Teams, and you become a hero, you can pick one of five outfits. I like Inferno because why not? Basically, if you're a superhero, you can just abuse. Like, there's not- I'm not even kidding. You can go out into the prisons, and you can kill cops, you can kill prisoners for no reason, even if they haven't done anything. You can just abuse, and it's not- it's not even funny. It's just really stupid how the mechanics of this superhero can work. It's just- you can do whatever you want, and it does not matter, like, whatsoever. Like, for example, if I go- you can just fly anywhere too. You can fly anywhere, and if you see like a prisoner or something, or a cop or anything, you can zoom in, you can shoot them like, with fireballs until they die. Like, here's a kid who just killed me. Look, I just killed him. I just killed that kid. And you know what? Nothing. Nothing. I just killed him. This is, look, this is basically abuse. Superheroes just do that. That's another thing that's bad about the game, like if you're just trying to survive and stuff. And also, if you're a superhero and you die, like, if I'm a superhero and I say, say I died, like someone killed me, like I just died, they drop some superpower thing, it's like a glitch in the game, and other criminals can pick that up and become a superhero themselves. And then we have superhero criminals with no powers, like, no, no recklessness or anything, just going around killing people for no reason, just having random powers that they obtain from somebody, and they're just killing cops like a beast, robbing banks, being crazy. They're just cheating the system, and it's crazy. It's it's strange. It, and I don't know what to say of this. I think it's a glitch. They should probably fix it immediately. It's not opening, but honestly, robbing, this was so... Oh, no. No. Oh my god, I thought that... Okay, I'm here to get- <laughs> He tried saving us! He said he tried right. saving us. That's br That brings us over to uh, reason number four. Feature number four. I mean. Feature number four is cops can arrest with a single- Basically, just a single click. All they have to do is click on the criminal where it says E or they press E just one time and they arrest them. Like, it's pretty fast to arrest people. Like, if you're a cop and you're going out and you see somebody and you just want to arrest them, like, because you're a cop, right? In Jailbreak, you used to have to hold E, make it more of a challenge. Uh, they should nerf that because right now the cops can just instantly arrest them and that's not even fair. Like, 
what if the criminal was really hard to hit and they just get pressed E on or whatever? That that doesn't make sense and that's like unfair on the cops. And finally to number five, our final reason the hardest thing in this game, like the hardest most strange feature, like it's one of the strangest features, is the RPG. The RPG is a rocket launcher basically. And if you get the RPG, it's really easy to get, basically, you just go to the criminal base or something, and you pick it up, like, see where it says the, see where, um, on my pointer it shows this little gunshot, I'm pretty sure that's where you go, and once you get the RPG, it one-shots everything, it's like, it's really game-breaking, it breaks everything, it kills cops one-shot, kills everything one-shot, it's pretty weird, and I don't know why it's a feature, but, yeah, that's, that's this game for you, you know? Let me just get the RPG so I can explain this. Yep. This game took over Jailbreak, and it probably is gonna fall soon. It's had 5 million visits in the past week. Oh, what's up, Chase? Hey. Say hi. Say hi, yeah. Hi, YouTube. Yeeks. People saying hi, YouTube. Alright. Basically, they can just come here and get an RPG. Like, if you go to... Here's the RPG. You don't even have to buy... Oh, well, you have to buy it for 400 Robux, but it's OP. Like, if you waste Robux on that, OP. You can't, you can't get beat with that. Like, for real. There's no way to beat it. It's, like, overpowered. And, uh, that brings us to an end for this video. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh... That's basically all I have to say about this new game and the five features that are pretty bad about it. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and make sure to hit um, the like button and subscribe for more amazing content. And that's basically it. Yeah.